Guys, what were the emotions like your uh, last game as Grizzly, Blake first, and Cody? It was very emotional. Uh, there's just so much you put into it, so much that many people don't know that you put in the hours you put in, the sweat and all that, you know, all that stuff. But just the connection you feel, just knowing that this is the last time you get to be on that field. For me, in general, it's the last time I'm be on the field in front of people, playing with my brothers and all that stuff. You know, but there's just there's just a lot. It's a lot to process, a lot to take in. I just loved everything of it. Just embraced it. Just tried to soak it all up. It's, it's, it's just amazing. Honestly. Yeah. Um, no, there's definitely a lot of emotion. It's hard to keep back the tears for most of the day, but it's fun to come out here. Your last time, you know, it's going to be your last game. Uh, just having fun with your teammates and stuff. Um, you know, it's, yeah, it's been tough, but wouldn't want it any other way. It's been a fun ride. Man. Go out beating Southern, yeah, yeah. That's a, that's a good rivalry there, and there's no better way to go out. There is. No and then I got a similar question for you guys. You know, you had those ceremonies happen just right in the middle of the game. Did you guys expect that? We were warned, so can't really lie there. But yeah. I mean, first year, uh, yeah. Grant Buckner, our first year here four years ago, Grant Buckner had the same situation. He was 27. He was retiring. Uh, Phil did something really special for him, and I, that honestly was one of the things that has stood out to me the most in my career here. It's just the fact that Phil does that for the players. It's, that doesn't happen everywhere, and it's, it's special. It's, I mean, that that really sits at home with me. It's, I'll remember that forever. This tonight, I'll remember it forever. And Blake, then I was on the field to see your whole ceremony, and I started feeling emotions just because you were showing emotions. Your mom and dad out on the field. Just it describes to us that experience, that your you know your whole journey through not just playing as a Grizzly, but your whole journey as a like, baseball player. Uh, like it's a journey, just like you said. It's I mean, you start at the bottom, you start not knowing up from down, you figure it out a little bit, and you go to the next level, start back at the bottom, don't know up from down, figure it out, go to the next level, and for all that to happen to culminate into that what I had on the field there these last four years, I'm just seeing the video, the teammates, the Phil, all the coaching staff, just seeing all that, it's just, I, I don't know, I don't really have words for it. It's, it's amazing. It's incredible. And uh, guys, each one of your favorite memory as a Grizzly? <laughs> There's a lot. That's There's a lot. Time. Yeah, four years a long time. <laughs> I can give you a couple right off the top. Honestly, my favorite memory of probably first year Cody hits a home run in his last in the last game of the season, and Cody's not known for his power. I, hey man, you like to sneak it in there, but so he hits that home run, and I mean, I lost it. I came out, and I I remember meeting him at about where the grass meets the dirt on the uh, right before the stairs into the dugout, and I picked him up. Just, I, I don't even know. I just blacked out. I was so happy. But that moment right there for me, it kind of just, call, it just summarizes my baseball career. It, it, like I said, it's a family. It's a brotherhood. You fight for these guys. You love these guys. Like, they're your brothers. So you want them to succeed as much as you want yourself to succeed. And that right there is one of my favorite memories, honestly, I'll take away from this game. Well, Tough follow there's, Yeah, there's not a lot to top that with. Um, I don't know. One of the coolest things I've ever seen, though, is... This guy hit one into the gutter on the building behind the left field wall. And that's a small gutter. <laughs> and it came out the bottom. So, hands down, coolest thing I've ever seen. Happy And then, guys, uh, just to wrap this thing full circle, you know, future expectations for you guys. You guys know, or are you guys just taking it one day at a time? For me, it's just one day at a time. I don't really know what next year is going to bring me, uh, I don't know where I'm going to end up. Or Anything like that is something we got to go over and figure out pretty soon. Um, for me, it's I, I have a couple things I need to get in line. Finishing up school, lining up jobs, things like that. But right now, I'm just I'm taking it one day at a time, just trying to really just remember all of this. Because it's just, it's, it's a time that not everybody gets, and 
I'm gonna enjoy it. I'm, I'm gonna soak it. In. You're great, guys. Go celebrate with your teammates. Thank you, thank you, gentlemen.